Hey, how's it going guys? Welcome to another Excel tutorial video. My name is Jay. In this lesson, I'm going to show you how to calculate number difference from previous period or previous year in your pivot table. Right, so here I have a simple data set, two columns. The first column is my period and the second column is my revenue. So basically my numbers. I'm going to select the table and go to insert pivot table to create a brand new pivot table. I'm going to insert the pivot table to my existing Excel file. I'm going to position my period to the row session. And I'll drag my total revenue to the value session. So this is the, the default view. The report is grouped by years. I want to uh, change the group setting. So I'll right click and go to group. So here I want to change the, the grouping by months and by year. So I'm going to uncheck quarters. And click on OK. So here we have two different groupings. So uh, for the months, these are going to be my periods. And for the year, this is going to be my year grouping. Now what I want to do is, while the pivot table is still select, I'm going to drag my total revenue to the value session two more times. Now you're going to see three identical columns. In column F, this is going to be the total revenue for each month. And here I have my aggregation for the year. In column G, I want to convert this to the uh, to the revenue difference against previous period. So what you want to do is want to right click and have your mouse to show value as. And here you're going to see a list of different options. You want to choose difference from. So here a dialog window will pop up and it's going to ask you to select the base field and the base item. Since I want to see the difference against previous month, so I'm going to leave the base field as period. For the base item, I'm going to choose previous. That means I want to see the difference between the current period and the previous period. Now click on OK. And pivot table will change the, the aggregation. Instead of presenting the total, it's going to present the period difference from current months against previous month. And here I'm going to change the, the label. I'm going to change the label to difference. This one's going to be first, previous period. For column H, I want to calculate the difference against uh, the same months from last year's number. So we'll follow the same step. So we'll select uh, the field in column H, right click, show value as, and want to select difference from. So here we're going to change the base field from period to years. And we're going to leave the base item to previous and click on OK. Now I'm going to change the label to difference and it's going to be first, last year's number. Now, if I look at this pivot table, then I can easily see what's the difference between this month and the last month, and what's the difference between uh, this month first, uh, the same month from last year, which gives you a lot more information when you are creating a report. All right, so this is everything I want to share in this video, and hopefully you guys found the video useful. And as always, see you guys watching. I'll see you guys on the next video.